Hi, this is Dr. Johnny Bowden, author of The 150 Healthiest Foods on Earth. And you know that old poem that has the quote, cabbages and kings? It's a line in, in an Elton John song as well. It's vegetable royalty, it's in the brassica family. And here's how we first found out about all the amazing benefits this has. Researchers looked at Polish women, and they noticed that Polish women had incredibly low rates of breast cancer. When they came to America, even though they were genetically identical to their sisters and, and, and landsmen over there in Poland, they started to get very high rates of breast cancer, or at least those that were concomitant with that in the American population. So what was it about their diet? What was it about their lifestyle? And we, they did a lot of research on this and found that the major thing that made their diet different between America and Poland was their use of cabbage. They eat a lot of cabbage over there in Poland, and it's a very good thing. Cabbage contains something called sulforaphane, which is a very detoxifying plant compound. It actually uh, turbocharges the liver's detox enzymes and helps you get rid of all kinds of carcinogens and environmental toxins. Now, it comes in different colors. The red or the purple kind actually is loaded with something called anthocyanins. Now, those are the pigments that give it its red or purple color, but they're also things that act as very powerful antioxidants antioxidants in your own body. They're actually in the flavonoid family and they act as anti-inflammatories and antioxidants. Cabbage also has calcium and magnesium and potassium and vitamin C and vitamin K and beta carotene. It's just sort of loaded with stuff. And one of the ways that we can actually get cabbage if you just don't like the smell or you don't, can't see yourself cooking it is to eat a lot of coleslaw. Just make it from fresh cabbage. Don't get the artificial kind. Just cut the stuff up and season it and you'll be getting all those benefits from the cabbage that way. Plus, there's four grams of fiber in one little cup and it has almost no calories. This is Dr. Johnny Bowden for Eat, Drink, or Die. Sign up for my free video series, Seven Nutrition Lies That Are Making You Sick and Fat, at johnnybowden.com.